Welcome to pre-math. In this video, we have got this triangle uh, ABC, as you can see in this uh, diagram, such that uh, this uh, CD is the altitude, and moreover, this side length uh, AD is uh, 9 uh, units, and this side length uh, BD is uh, 12. And furthermore, uh, this angle uh, DBC is uh, 2x, and this angle uh, ACD is X. And now we are going to calculate the length uh, AC, this side length uh, BC, and this uh, length uh, CD. Please don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe. Let me make it very clear that this figure may not be 100% uh, true to the scale. Let's go ahead and get started. And here's our very first step. Let's focus on this uh, triangle uh, ADC. We know that this angle is uh, 90 degrees. Now let's assume that this uh, angle is uh, our angle alpha. And now let's recall uh, triangle sum theorem. The sum of three interior angles in a triangle is always uh, 180 degrees. So therefore, some of these uh, three angles uh, must be 180 degrees. So let me go ahead and write down angle alpha plus uh, angle x plus uh, 90 degrees must be equal to 180 degrees. Let's go ahead and move uh, x and this 90 degrees on the other side. So therefore our angle uh, alpha turns out to be 90 degrees minus uh, x. So therefore, I'm going to replace this angle alpha by 90 degrees minus x. And here's our next step. Let's focus on this another right triangle uh, BDC. And let's assume that this uh, angle is uh, our angle beta. And now let's recall this uh, triangle sum theorem once again. The sum of these uh, three interior angles in this uh, triangle must be equal to 180 degrees. So therefore, let me go ahead and write down angle uh, beta plus angle uh, 2x plus uh, 90 degrees is going to be equal to 180 degrees. Let me go ahead and move uh, this uh, 2x and 90 degrees uh, on the right hand side. And if we simplify everything, our angle beta is going to become uh, 90 degrees minus uh, to x. So therefore our this angle beta I'm going to replace this one by 90 degrees minus uh, 2x. And now let's make an observation. This whole angle ACB is equal to these two individual angles x and 90 degrees minus uh, 2x. Let's go ahead and add them up uh, to find this whole angle. And if we add uh, this whole angle ACB is going to be 90 degrees minus uh, X. And now let's focus uh, on this uh, side length uh, AB. That is going to be some of these uh, two individual uh, side lengths 9 and 12. If we add them, we are going to get uh, 21 units. And now let's make an observation. We can see that this whole angle is uh, congruent to this angle. Both of them are 90 degrees minus x and this one is 90 degrees uh, minus x as well. So therefore we conclude that this uh, triangle uh, ABC is an isosceles uh, triangle. So that means uh, this side length uh, AB has got to be equal to this side length uh, BC. And we know that this uh, side length AB is 21. So therefore, uh, this side length BC has got to be 21 units as well. So thus our this side length uh, BC turns out to be 21 uh, units. And now let's uh, focus on this uh, right triangle uh, BTC once again. And we know two of its uh, side lengths are uh, known. Now we are going to find out uh, this uh, vertical uh, CD. So therefore, we are going to use the Pythagorean theorem. And here's our Pythagorean theorem, a square plus b square equal to c square. Let me go ahead and call our longest leg as our side c. I'm going to call this side a and this side b. And now we are going to calculate this side b. Now let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula. So a in our case is 12. So this is going to become 12 square plus uh, 
b square equals to c in our case is 21 so this is going to become 21 square let's go ahead and simplify we got 144 plus b square equals to 441 now let's go ahead and subtract 144 from both sides this is gone so our b square is going to be equal to 200 and uh, 97 now let's go ahead and take the square root on both sides to undo this uh, square so therefore this square and square root is gone so b is going to be equal to and now let's focus on the right hand side i have just copied it down square root of 297 that could be written at 9 times 33 we broke it down and it turns out to be equal to 3 times the square root of 33 so therefore our b value turns out to be 3 times the square root of 33 and we know that this our side length b is same as this whole length cd so therefore our cd length turns out to be 3 times the square root of 33 units and here's our final step let's focus on this right triangle adc and we know its uh, two side lengths uh, are known. This is 9 and this is 3 times square root of 33. So we are going to calculate uh, this uh, side length uh, AC now. So therefore we are going to use uh, Pythagorean theorem once again. And here's our Pythagorean theorem once again. A square plus B square equal to C square. Let me go ahead and call this side uh, A, this side uh, B and this uh, longest leg is our side uh, C. So let's go ahead and fill in the blanks in this uh, formula. Uh, a in our case is 9, so it's going to become 9 square plus uh, B is 3 times the uh, square root of 33 whole square equal to, we are going to figure out uh, C square. Now let's go ahead and simplify. This uh, 9 square is going to be 81 plus uh, square of this thing is going to give us uh, 297 equal to c square so therefore c square is equal to 378 let's go ahead and undo this square by taking a square root uh, on both uh, sides we can see this uh, square and square root is gone so c is going to be equal to and now let's focus on the right uh, hand side i have copied it down over here and if we factor that thing out that is going to be equal to 9 uh, times 42 with the square root and if we separate them uh, it turns out to be equal to 3 times the uh, square root of 42 so therefore our c value turns out to be 3 times the uh, square root of uh, 42 and now we know that this our side length C is the same as uh, this uh, whole side length AC. So thus our side length uh, AC turns out to be 3 times the uh, square root of 42 units. So thus we figured out all our missing sides. Uh, this missing side AC, this missing side uh, BC and this uh, missing side uh, CD as you can see over here. And that's our final answer. Thanks for watching and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos. Bye.